Alright guys, this is it. This is the, what's this called? The whole taco challenge. Hey, only one shot. We we'll only need one shot. So let's try it. <clears throat> what's so great about stuff being bloody? I don't care if it says it in English, it's still blood. I hate blood. If you're covered in blood, it doesn't mean you're cool. It means you're hurt. And what's so cool about madness? Why would anyone want to be crazy? I sure don't. There's nothing good about it. I don't understand. And what about sinful, huh? Why would that be a good thing? And what in redeemable sin supposed to be even better? If sinful people are cool, then does that mean all the criminals in the world are cool too? Then what's chaos supposed to mean anyway? Do you actually mean it literally? Then what's the point even? Why does everything always have to be black this and white that? Being in monochrome doesn't make things cool. It makes them boring. I like colorful stuff. I like pink and green and yellow. How's red any different from crimson? How's blue any different from azure? This isn't art class. Just use normal words. What do you mean darkness? What's so special about it? You like it when it's dark out? You think gloomy days are cool? And why do you have to have a dark side? There's no way having one of those would be anything other than awful. You know that having multiple personality is a mental disorder, right? Same with seventh syndrome. It's not a superpower, it's a condition with people struggle with. Why would you want that? Do you realize how hard it must be to live with? And why would you want to have homicidal impulses? You can't get by without killing people. That's supposed to be amazing somehow. Well, it's not. There's nothing cool about killing people. Of course there isn't. If you have to pick between good and evil, why do you always have to go with evil? That's not the right choice. Isn't it obvious? Why would evil be good? Evil is evil. What's so cool about your arm throbbing? You like how it feels when you can't hold back your own power back? That doesn't make you look cool. It makes you look stupid. People who can control themselves are the cool ones. They're praiseworthy. And what's so incredible about hiding your true power? That just means you're being lazy. Cool people put their all into everything they do. Cool people try. You think having white hair and red eyes is stylish? It's not. It's creepy. Only rabbits have eyes like that. Slaughter, calamity, devastation, vicious, malevolence, hollow, terminal. Why do you always go so far out of your way to use all these stupid scary words? Are you trying to curse someone or what? There are plenty of nice words out there. Use those instead. Why do you have to give titles to everyone and everything? Having a ton of nicknames just make things confusing. Especially when, 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 when they're all random English gibberish. How am I supposed to remember those? And same for true names. What does that even mean? What does giving yourself a true name actually do for you? Stop saying wrecking on when you just say, you could just say song. Stop saying taboo when you could just say bad. Stop saying jihad when you could just say war. And stop saying war when you could just say fight. Destruction isn't a clever word on play on words. Nobody cares if slaughter is laughter with an S. Using awesome with his old definition doesn't make you sound smart. Don't just read some article about Greek mythology and talk my ear off about it. Some of same with for North mythology and Japanese and the Bible. You think the names in them are cool? That's it? I won't understand if you won't actually tell me what any of them mean. What sort of gods are Amaterasu and Tsukuyomi? What did Zeus and Odin actually do in their stories? So Lucifer, Lucifer was an archangel before he became a falling angel and is the falling part cool? Is that it? If you're going to teach me about this stuff, then actually teach me about it. And I mean the whole picture and not just the weapons that show up in them. There's nothing fun about hearing about those. I have no idea what Gungner or Longinus or Excalibur or Jondo or I mean no more Kumo no Tsurugi are. I don't care. I don't understand what's so cool about them at all. And that goes for all the other random terms you used to. You go on and on about original sin and the Ten Commandments. And Genesis and Revelations, Armageddon. And they're all, aren't their names great? What does that mean? How can you tell if something's cool from his name? And then you tell me I just have to get feel for it? Well, I can't. Dumb stuff still looks dumb to me, no matter how many times I see it. And besides, I've never been interested in messing religious texts and stuff in the first place. Even the animals in them are all creepy. Cerebrus, Ouroboros, Yamato no Orochi, Fenrir, Phoenixes. They're all just weird. I like normal animals, cute ones. I like puppies and kittens. 
just because you did a little research online about the theory of relativity or strong gear cat or universal gravitation or whatever doesn't mean you're some kind of expert if you don't even know what you're talking about there's no way i'm going to understand your explanation it just give me a headache stop quoting nice sec or goat at me i don't even know who they are so so they're headaches stop quoting ah, ah, ah. I so their quote doesn't mean anything to me. I won't understand what you're trying to say at all. Talk to me in your words. Please, for once, just say something I can understand. What is Shuni? What is Shuni mean? I don't understand. 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 Jew. I never, ever understand a single word you ever say to me dang dude all right i guess that's my one shot bro you only get one chance that's my one shot bro my one shot for the hatako rant right if you want to do the hatako uh challenge i'll post the link below too but basically just put out a video of you and twitter and just put like hashtag how to go challenge and then they also give you a link to the script right here. It's pretty fun. I kind of liked it. I'm not going to lie. My eyes were a little bit... I, like, uh, I couldn't see. I couldn't see, right? Where am I? But let's add a little ad lip to it. Anyway, appreciate everyone that stopped by. It's been cool. And that was my version on the Hadako Rants. One shot, by the way, right? Because that was a challenge, right? You got to do it one shot. One take, one shot. That's all I need. All right. Later, bye.